coming down to the next part of the same question, um, you know, being a content creator as a a uh, child of God as a minister, yes, there is a set of standards expected of you. And uh, like in your case, because of your name, because of, you know, the ministry name, in my case right now, out of the blue, I noticed this, like the minute the podcast started raising up the charts, you know, there is a standard that's expected of you. But in that regard, you know, you have to stick to the standard. And at the same time, you have to be consistent so how do you balance between, you know, um, creating content that is consistent and up to the standard at the same time, it's not out of your flesh that you are forced to do because you have to, to do it, but you are doing uh, out of the inspiration of the Holy Spirit. Um, yeah, sometimes when you're uh, in work mode, you want to meet the deadlines, you want to keep posting um, every week and you don't want to miss out. Um, but you also want to give quality content. You don't just want to give like something to fill in those days. Um, yes, even I, I mean, like a lot of times I burn out and I, uh, if I don't think the idea is perfect, I don't go through with it. I'm a very like perfect, uh, perfectionist kind of a person. So um my friends yell at me, why aren't you posting regularly your vlogs? And even in the comments, people say, I'm a new subscriber, I need new vlogs. But um, yes, life does get in the way. But then you should be intentional about everything that you post. At the end of the day, people aren't going to see uh, if you've posted every single week, they're going to see the content that you put out. So everything that you uh, release, uh, even, it's in, even if it's in your job, every project that you do, even if it's in your schoolwork, everything that you do, it needs to uh, be the best that you can give out. So uh, putting in the time, putting in the effort, and also creating a plan beforehand so that you can give your best. At the end of the day, it doesn't just reflect you, but it reflects who you're representing, which is God. Um, so that's what I try to tell people. Um, all the young people who watch, they ask, um, uh, what, how should I do this? How are you able to organize your day? How can you get things done? How, could, how to not procrastinate? It's all in the intention of what, um, uh, what are you doing this for at the end of the day? What are you trying to accomplish? What are you trying to say with the things that you create? So uh, always have that in mind. It's everything that you re do reflects on God. So give your best. Amen. Yeah, that's absolutely true. Like the scripture says, right, whatever you do it, do it unto the glory of God. So.